November 30th, 1016. Canute the Great, King of Denmark, claims the English throne after the death of Edmund Ironside. 1753. Benjamin Franklin receives the Godfrey Copley Medal on account of his curious experiments and observations on electricity. 1866. Work begins on the first United States underwater highway tunnel in Chicago. 1866. The first commercially successful AC electric power plant opens in Buffalo, New York. 1900. A German engineer patents front-wheel drive for automobiles. 1902. In the American Old West, the second-in-command of Butch Cassidy's Wild Bunch Gang, Kid Curie Logan, was sentenced to 20 years imprisonment with hard labor for crimes against the people. 1924. The first photo facsimile transmitted across the Atlantic Ocean by radio waves occurred when a picture was sent from London to New York City. 1928, Vladimir K. Zworkin receives a patent on the Iconoscope TV system, which is the basis for our modern television sets. 1956, at just under 22 years of age, Floyd Patterson becomes the youngest world heavyweight boxing champion. He KOs Archie Moore in the fifth round in Chicago. He is also the first Olympic gold medalist to win a professional heavyweight title. 1958, the first U.S. guided missile destroyer is launched, the Dewey. It's launched out of the Bay Iron Works in Maine. 1969, American singer-songwriter Neil Diamond makes his only appearance on The Ed Sullivan Show, singing Sweet Caroline and Holly Holy. 1971, Emmy and Peabody award-winning TV movie Brian's song about the friendship of Chicago Bears football teammates Brian Piccolo and Gail Sayers premieres on ABC. It starred James Caan and Billy Dee Williams. 1979, Pink Floyd's The Wall album is released. It sells 6 million copies in two weeks. 1982, Gandhi, directed by Richard Attenborough and starring Ben Kingsley and John Googler, premieres in New Delhi. It would go on to win the Best Picture of 1983. 1982, Thriller, the sixth studio album by Michael Jackson is released. The Grammy Award Album of the Year for 1984 is the best-selling album of all time, and it's Billboard's Album of the Year for 1983. 1991, there was an accident on San Francisco highways during a dust storm. By the end of the events, this wreck included 93 cars, 11 trucks, and 17 people lost their lives. 2004, longtime Jeopardy! champion Ken Jennings of Salt Lake City, Utah finally loses, leaving him with 2,520,700 United States dollars. Television's all-time biggest game show wins. 2017, the world's longest recorded rainbow. It was taped for 8 hours and 58 minutes in Tapai. These are just a few of the things that have happened today, November 30th in history. This has been Mr. Scott with Today in History. Thanks for watching.